Hi, today I'm going to show you how you can open something from Google Drive in Notability. The first thing I need to do is launch Google Drive. Now, if you're not signed into an account, you'll have to do that first thing. I am signed into a, an account and I'm going to show you a newspaper article that I created um, to use in Notability. So I'll go to the folder that that's in and I put it in this handouts folder. I've also placed it inside of a grade level folder for fourth grade. Once I find and locate the item that I want to open, which is this longer all a dot 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 e poster dot pdf, I'll give it a tap and I'll see a preview of the item. Now the toolbar at the top that's shaded in gray is very important. If you don't see that toolbar like this for example, just give the item a tap and it'll come back. What you would like to do is tap the three dots. You'll get a new menu there that says open in or print. We want to use open in <clears throat> and then what Noti or, um, Google Drive does is gives you a selection of all the different apps that you have on your iPad that will be able to open this PDF document. We obviously want to choose Notability in this case. So that will launch Notability once I touch that app tile and it will ask me a couple questions. Uh, this time it says create new note, add to another note, or if I'm in an existing note it will also give me the option to add to this note or I can also cancel if I made a mistake. This time I'm going to hit create new and what you'll see in a second is Notability pulls this file in and now I can use the tools in Notability to do things like follow the directions here and write my name. So that's how easy it is to open things from Google Drive into Notability. You can use the same steps that I just showed to follow with other items like Dropbox or Box that you may use as storage service for your iPad. This also will work in iTunes U very similarly. So that's how you can open items from a service like Google Drive, which I think is the easiest way right now to do this, um, into Notability to get your kids their assignments. I hope you found this tutorial helpful, and as always, thanks for watching.